In this video, you'll be learning how to calculate the volume of square pyramids. Before we begin, make sure you have this sheet either printed off or pulled up digitally. So this is the first type of pyramid that you learn how to calculate the volume for. And we just finished learning about the volume of prisms. Before you watched this video, you were supposed to watch a video that showed a prism and a pyramid. And the pyramid was being filled with water and then poured into the prism. What we learned is that if a prism and pyramid have the same base and the same height, it would take three pyramids to completely fill that prism. In other words, three pyramids fit inside one prism. The other way to look at that would be saying that a pyramid is one third the volume of a prism. And we use this information to get our formula for the volume of a pyramid. To find the volume of a pyramid, you first start by finding the volume of a prism. And a prism comes from V equals capital B times H. But since a pyramid is one third of a prism, we then take that answer and divide it by three. So very, very similar to finding the volume of a prism, the difference is that divided by three. So the letters stand for the same thing they did in a prism. V is the volume, capital B is the area of your base, and H is the height, this time, of the pyramid. So today we're gonna to focus on square pyramids. So what that means is the base is a square. To find the area of a square, you can do two separate things. So you can either do side times side, or that would be side squared. So let's look at some examples. In the first example, it says that our base is a square with side length of three centimeters. Since it's a square, that also means that this side is three centimeters and the other sides would be three centimeters. To first find the area of that square, I would take three times three or three squared. And that gives me that my area of my base would be nine square centimeters. The height of that pyramid is four. So what I would be doing to calculate the volume is the base times the height divided by three. So in this particular example, nine times four divided by three. Nine times four is 36 divided by three gives me a final volume of 12 cubic centimeters. If we look at the next example, I again have a square base that side length is three centimeters. So to find the area of that base square here, I would be doing three times three, which is nine. The height this time is much higher, it's 15. So to find the volume, I would be doing nine times 15 and then divided by three, which gets me a final answer of 45. So the biggest thing with pyramids is that you remember to divide by three at the end. That's the newest part and how to calculate the volume of a square pyramid. Good luck.